Hey guys, welcome back. This tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to decompile maps and also to use some items from maps that you see. Um, I do not condone stealing anything from a map, but it's always nice to kind of reverse engineer it to see how they did what they did in their maps. I think that's a, a healthy way to look at it. All right, first thing you want to do is download a program called VMAX. You can probably just Google it. If you're having trouble finding it, just ask. Now you want to execute this jar file. And this little window will pop up like this. Cool. All right, so next thing you want to do, either have all the BSP files that you want to decompile in one place, or you can just refer to your Maps folder and your C Strike folder. Click Browse. Um, you want to go to Computer. Uh, C drive, program files, Steam, Steam apps, your username, um, Counter Strike source, C Strike maps. Here will be all the maps that you have. Cool stuff. I highly suggest copying the BSP file out of here and putting them in a folder because you're going to lose where you decompile your map. Alright, so let me choose something. Um, okay, how about this guy? You click decompile. Now it might take a few minutes. There's no real indicator on if it's working or not. But if you open the file, uh, open the folder where your BSP file was, you should find a VMF file in there now. That's a good thing. That means that it worked. Now you want to open Hammer. And now you can click open, find the map you just decompiled, and everything should work just fine. And you, you can learn from other people's maps just by uh, decompiling them and looking at them. Now again, please do not steal anything from anybody's map. But seeing how something's done is a great way to learn. This is a B-hop map. Everybody pretty much knows this one if they've B-hopped at all. And let's say you were having trouble trying to find a B-hop tutorial to make a map online. You can just decompile one and figure it out. You can see that there's a trigger teleport. And... Remote destination is where it teleports you to if you land in it. Click mark and you can find where that goes. Check it out. Also, some textures will not show up properly. And just in one minute, I'm going to show you how to take a look at those. All right, to do that, you op uh, download a program called PackRat. Open that up. And you're going to want to open up uh, the original map file, the BSP file. And isn't that nice? It shows you all of the materials from that map. 
this program is the same program that you'll need to use to put your um, custom files in your map file so people can use your textures that you made or whatever looks like these are all standard but if there were some you can always save them and use them I hope this helped you please rate comment and subscribe I'll be sure to put some more videos up take care and um, have a great day.